Marcus. I don't have time for this, Helena. And as I've illustrated before, it's Mr. Slade. How could you do that to a patient? Not a patient. A test subject. You're inhuman. Human, not human. I thought these were the boundaries that we'd agreed to operate on the fringes of. I would never have agreed to this. But never is a very strong word, Helena. And in this case, it couldn't be further from the truth. You've agreed to our little arrangement dozens of times. What are you talking about? Well, the young college upstart makes waves in tech with groundbreaking research on memory and Alzheimer's that coincidentally matches your life work. That's funny. Are you suggesting you stole my research? Well, it's a bit more complicated than that, but that's the general idea, yes. Wow. Time travel? Do I have to spell this out for you? You are a lot sharper as my superior. Oh, yes. Little Marcus Slade was once a lowly lab assistant to the brilliant Dr. Smith, who used to have a lot less moral scruples than she does now. You're lying. Maybe.